morning guys we're back here and welcome to the vlog this is vlog number 70 and it is 8 33 on tuesday october 8th yeah that is correct make sure i have my uh dates down october already uh you know the halloween season is near or coming near um hope everyone is having a good time I missed yesterday uh mostly because i overslept again i uh haven't been sleeping that well so when I oversleep to like 8.45 or 9, it, the vlog's already passed because they come out at 9 o'clock. But I hope everyone had a good weekend, and we're back at it today. So, what are we talking about? Um, nothing's been really going on. Just normal days at work, and uh, we are preparing to go back home for the weekend. we got to go to a wedding back home. Um, so, I'm pretty excited on Friday to get uh, drive and head back. It should be pretty fun. And let's see, what new things have I heard about? Um, things that I've been kind of keeping up with is, um, the new Joker movie. Uh, I've been trying, I was going to go see it over the weekend, but I didn't get a chance. Um, and based on what I had read, uh, it's kind of, it's kind of split. Either people think it's really good. Uh, and these people include, uh, my brother said it was really good. And Cortland, uh, who did movie reviews on the channel, uh, said it was good, which gives me some, you know, Pretty high hopes and expectations for the movie, but also there was some something I had read uh, where people had been walking out of the movie because of the it apparently it was uh, too much for them uh, kind of thing. Uh, the movie was just a little too much on the mental issues and that kind of thing. But that's kind of was expected a little bit from a Joker movie talking about his backstory, kind of knowing the character. So I figured I'd give it you know another week or two. Let it see how everything's going with it and make sure, you know, before I go and see it, that, you know, it's not, like, sunk in the water. Uh, also, that gives us a little bit more time for people to go see it so the theaters won't be as crowded. Um, since it came out fairly recently, I'm pretty sure. Um, and then another thing I was keeping up with uh, was the Twitch affiliate ad revenues. Uh, I thought that was pretty interesting. I do Twitch very minimally, me and Nicole both do. Um, and we're actually... Slowly creeping up to affiliate. Um, what I find most interesting is that they're going to give affiliates uh, some money based on ad revenue, which I think is actually very good for the affiliate program. Uh, based on some of the friends we have and some of the people we've talked to, uh, the problem that comes to affiliate is you don't you don't make so much money that it ends up like coming to fruition uh, unless you have a pretty big following. Uh, the money you make through bits and subscriptions don't ever add up enough to uh you know make a decent amount to actually start into it unless, unless you got a good following um and then when it comes to, around to tax time they actually they hit you pretty hard because you are uh i think you have to claim it as small like a small business owner kind of thing so you lose out uh on some of that stuff and have to pay a little bit more into taxes because of that which um depending you know how much that extra payout might be, you might actually be losing a substantial amount of money uh, opting into, you know, accepting the money from Twitch. So I think that was pretty interesting. I think that's like another little incentive. Uh, Twitch has been a growing platform, so I can see why they would, you know, want to keep people on it and keep their, you know, affiliates, you know, coming and making content. Um, that being said, uh, I'm curious, you know, what the statistics will end up Avering out ads, if it'll be the same or, you know, what will keep uh, partners there, like what benefits they'll get. Because uh, originally they got the ad revenue and the affiliates didn't. So I'm wondering kind of what little changes will be made there uh, into of what the partner will get. Um, and I'm curious if they'll eventually ro roll out some of the, uh, the different uh, features to the affiliates. Like uh, squad streams, I've seen is a thing that uh, a couple of the people that I watch have done. And stuff like that. I'm wondering if those features will come to the affiliate soon also. Or if that'll stay on like the partner level. Which is very hard to get to. Um, currently I think we are at 47 I want to say. I'm kind of curious. 47 followers. And uh, uh, whatchamacallit. I'm trying to figure, think of the words I'm trying to use. 47 followers, and then you have to hit an average of so many uh, viewers per uh, all your streamed hours. Uh, so yeah, the 
goals for a path to affiliate is you need 50 followers, which we are really close at 47. Um, you need to stream for eight hours. We're at 54.1, so covered there. Uh, stream on seven different days. We've streamed on 26. And then an average of three viewers over the amount of hours you stream. And we're at 2.35 uh, average viewers over 54 hours. So we, we got a ways to go on that one. Um, but then like the jump from that to partner is crazy. Stream for 25 hours. We've uh, streamed for 25 hours. We streamed for five hours, is it? Oh, performance per 30 days, the difference. Uh, so you have to stream for 25 hours over 30 days. Uh, and this is from uh, 9, 9 to 10, 8 that we've streamed five hours. Does it sound correct? Hmm. I streamed five hours the other day. Anyway, I uh, stream on 12 different days, which we've streamed on 26. And then an average of 75 viewers. That's the hard one. The getting the average viewers is hard. You know, you got to build that following. Uh, you got to have people who want to come and see you. So we have friends that'll come and hang out, but you know, we're still building up that group of other people uh, to come and hang out. But you know, it's just kind of a hobby for us. We enjoy it. We've made a lot of new friends, and you know, it's nice, relaxing thing to do in the afternoons. Anyways, guys, that's been another vlog. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, you can hit that like button or subscribe if you want to see more. And if you'd like to come check us out on Twitch, we stream uh, Mondays, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday on twitch.tv slash goldcrownstudios. You can jump in. Uh, we're hanging out there. So anyways, guys, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.